In an eye on a volcano, an actor's new business venture, and taking the pounds off with potatoes. Here are five things to know before you go to bed. A Hawaiian volcano continues to spew ash and lava, the world's largest active volcano, sending lava up to 200 feet high on Hawaii's Big Island. This as spectators come to a national park to witness the spectacular event. The volcano erupted this week for the first time in 38 years. Hawaii's health department says the eruption currently poses the biggest risk to air quality. Amazon says this past Thanksgiving shopping weekend was its biggest ever. Amazon reported that independent businesses brought in more than $1 billion in sales. Shoppers spent an average of $325 on holiday gift purchases. According to the National Retail Federation, nearly 200 million people shopped online and in stores, up 17 million compared to last year. Researchers say potatoes are an effective food to help people lose weight. The nutrient-dense starch is low in calories but very filling. According to a study from scientists in Louisiana, nutritionists believe potatoes can be an important part of a healthy diet when trying to shed some pounds, but we assume they're not talking about french fries. Guess not. Well, Dr. Oz reportedly wants to bring his old TV career back to life. So far, networks aren't buying. A source tells online publication Radar Online that Oz is having trouble getting new gigs because he's become too politically polarizing after his failed Senate run in Pennsylvania. Some have speculated there could still be a home for Dr. Oz at Fox News or Newsmax, but no firm offers have materialized. Oz's health-oriented talk show ran from September 2009 through January 2022. Tom Hanks' new venture gives back to veterans and their families. The actor is launching a company called Hanks for Our Troops. It's starting out with a coffee line that comes in three blends. 100% of the profits will go to organizations that benefit veterans. There you go. That's five things to know before you go to bed.